of the men in red have come a win tonight and will have the third most points in all of Major League Soccer as they get set for another home match here in Bridgeview, Illinois. Tonight it's the second meeting against the Montreal Impact. Record away from the friendly confines. A look at the starting 11. Some pretty talented players amongst the group, Evan. A lot of wonderful addition to the technical staff of the Fire as the head coach. His starting lineup, more of the same, Sergio McDonald and Chris Rolfe. The they, didn't, they didn't finish him off. You know, Patrick Nianco missing that breakaway chance. Could have really ended the game. Hopefully, it'll be a different result this evening. So off we go. So now Marco Bravallo from the corner. First one tonight for the impact. Nicely launched in, getting ahead on it. Sean Johnson had it, and on the rebound, Montreal trying to pry it out of the keeper's hands. Sean Johnson coming for that ball. And I want to say number six, Kamara lunging at it. Johnson getting the benefit of the doubt from the referee. But he had his, his hands in that ball, and Kamara coming through. Whistled for the foul. Fire dodging the bullet early here. About a 10% advantage also in terms of possession for Patrice Bernier and the impact so far. Coming down, Jaleel Baba. Sean Johnson can't stop it. DeVaio the blast, low and slow was the job there, and Montreal leads 1-0. Marco DeVaio, the 36-year-old, former Serie A forward. It's a nice header, and Barry and Friedrich caught in the middle there. DeVaio playing well in the gaps. It's a very nice ball. Cross with a header. He just finds himself in the seam there. Nice little cut on Friedrich. Johnson gets a paw to a Strong shot, doesn't do enough to carry that wide. The bio is a frequent finisher. He will punish you and give him the opportunity, as you see there. Austin Berry, he hasn't pushed forward too much. Hasn't had a chance. Logan Paws, Chris Rolf into Alex. Turns in the left foot drive, blocked by Nesta. Rolf gets it. Getting. The ball from about 20 yards away, but can't find the open seam. That's how you create holes. Moves like that, Anibaba, the pause. Back to Jaleel Anibaba. Curls it. Defensive work to close down there. He will get scolded at halftime for that. We talked about that earlier. Those offensive guys, they don't want to do the defensive work. He's still gaining full form. Felipe, flick into the box. Alibaba taking his man down. Now Arno lets it fly from 20 yards and can't get it through as Davey had a good crack at it. Will be a corner kick for Montreal, the first corner by either side in the second half. Davy Arno is thinking this has goal of the year written all over it. It's a bit of a broken play as Felipe chips this into the bio. But it comes out to Davy Arno. It's a wicked curving left-footed shot. 
luckily deflecting off the fire defense. Fernandez. Alex. Head of the area. Fires. Upper 90. Alex, how are you doing? sequence and it's a quick ball from Alex to Fernandez a nice little chip he does well to take it down in that left foot we've seen it before sits nicely for him a little chip over Perkins top shelf fire up 2-1 that's a great goal from Alex that's my man of the match Dan he was the man there two new guys combined delicate beautiful first touch from Flacco to spring the Brazilian Arno trying to lose Alvaro Fernandez. Justin Mapp, great read by Segaris to push up. Now it's Alvaro Fernandez. McDonald trying to get by the old guy. It's Nesta, he can recover well. McDonald turns, fires right into the belly of Troy Perkins. Rolf, Oduro, via Diaco to Barry. Cricket Wireless, get the most out of your wireless plan with unlimited music. Cricket, your call. Rolf, marching down the right side. Great cross for Andy. Montreal trotting down the left side. Nyasi. Bernier will spin it. Comes down to Justin Mapp. Davey Arno. Montreal impact run out of time for Frank Lopas and the Chicago Fire. Victory is mine. Crucial three points. 